Hi everyone, I am Sangeetha, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science, Kaiser Alson Science College for Women. Today we learn about Web Technology Unit 2, Tables. Tables display information in row and columns. They are commonly used to display all manner of data that fit in a grid. For example, row, 4 row, 4 columns. That is the example of tables. Here you can see the grid of rectangle. Each rectangle is known as a cell. A row is made up of set or cell on the same line from left to right. And a column is made up of a line of cell going from top to bottom. You create a table in HTML using table element. Inside the table element, the table is written out row by row. A row is contained inside a TR element which stands for table row. Each cell is then written inside the row element using TD element which stands for table data. Here this is a code that was used to create basic table. Example table border equal to 1 TR element TD row 1 column 1 TD close TD open row and column td close tr close i mean table uh, table row la first row first column uh, td uh, first first row second column tr uh, second row start row to column 1 row to column 2 second row end table end basic table element and attributes the table element create a tables a table element is the containing element for all table it can carry the following attributes all the universal attribute basic event of attribute for scripting the table element can carry the following decrypted attributes a yeah, align attribute when used with the table element it indicate whether the table should be aligned to the left default right or center of the page table align equal to center that means uh, default alignment is left. The PG color attribute. The PG color attribute set the background color of the table. PG color equal to within quotes red. The border attribute. If the if you use, use the border attribute, a border will be created around both the table and each individual cell. The value for all attribute in with you want to outside the border of the table to be in pixel border equal to within quotes 0 cell padding attribute the cell padding attribute is used to create a gap between the edge of cell and its contents cell padding equal to within quotes 5 the cell padding attribute the cell padding attribute is used to create a space between the border of each cell cell spacing equal to within quotes 6 the dir attribute the dir attribute is support to indicate the direction of text that is used in the table possible value or ltr from far left to right text and rtl for right to left dir equal to within quotes rtl the frame attribute the frame attribute is supposed to control the appearance of the outermost border of whole table Refer to here as it frame with greater control than the border attribute. If both the frame and border attribute are used the frame attribute take the precedency. The syntax is frame equal to within quotes frame type. The summary attribute. The summary attribute is supports to provide a summary of the table. Purpose and structure for non-visual browsers such as speech browser or barely browsers. The width attribute. The width attribute is used to specify the width of the table and usually it is value is given in pixel. Width equal to within quotes 500. The TR elements contain table row. The TR element is used to contain each row in table. Anything appear within a TR element should appear on the same row. It can carry 5 attributes. 3 of which have been deprecated in favor of using CSS. Align PG color care, care of V align. This is the attributes used in TR element. The APPR 
sorry a bbr attribute the a bbr attribute is used to provide an abbreviated version of the cells contain a bbr equal to description of the service the height attribute the height attribute allow you to specify the height of your cell in pixel or as a percentage of the available space height equal to 20 or height equal to 10 percentage thank you